Imagine meeting a huge group of people being thrown onto a stage and then given 24 hours to orchestrate a concert. For students at Bibb County High Schools, that is exactly what's going on right now. Suzanne Lawler shows us how this mammoth project came together and you and how you can listen to the result this weekend. One and two and one, two, one. I'm not used to a 12 hour um, practice at all. You can't blame William Barnes as he musters up the energy for the marathon. The Northeast Raider bolsters this honor band with his baritone. It's a big trumpet, small tuba. That's how I explain it. Band director Dominique Lane is from Crisp County and he says it is A-OK -okay for these musicians to blow their own trumpet. Literally started at 10 o'clock on a Friday and on 3 o'clock on a Saturday we're performing a concert. We take a month to get pieces together to prepare and play. The deadline is daunting and that by itself would be noteworthy, but these musicians have never met each other. Each high school sent their best to make up the concert honor band. And not only is Saturday's concert cool, it's also historic. They've never had this kind of an effort bringing everybody together in Bibb County. Lane says he wants to strike a chord with the kids by rolling out songs they haven't played before. It's just another challenge that adds to the experience. I've heard stuff already that I've never heard before when it comes to musical notes and phrases and it's like being, you know, just surrounded by professionals and people that really know what they're doing. It strikes a chord of confidence to gifted teenagers in one of the biggest musical moments in their lives. Suzanne Lawler, 13 WMAZ News. All right, that concert is tomorrow afternoon, 3 o'clock at the Rutland High School Performing Arts Center on Skipper Road. It is free. The show should last, Suzanne said, around 30 minutes or so.